Hi again, uh, this is going to be a very very short video. Uh, basically I'm just going to show you how to password protect all of your admin pages from this point on. So uh, again just remember we've got the system where we have a, a session running and um, when we come into the admin panel obviously we can log out at any point. Uh, and if I log in it activates our admin session. So what we're going to do is we're just going to create um, a page. I'll just uh, find if I can. There we go, my sitemap. Um, we're just going to be working in the next tutorial on how to add and confirm the categories and so on. So I'm just going to go ahead and create my add category page now. Um, I'm going to base it on the original template I created. So I'll just open up my original template. And I'm just going to save a copy as add category okay so um, I'll just put a little heading down here in my content area just so that I have some um, idea of what page is loaded so I'll just put add new category uh, and now at the top what we need to do is put a little bit of code that detects whether or not um, the admin session is running so the first thing I need to do on all of these pages will be to start the session and then really all I'm checking to see is if it has been set or not now what I'm going to do is I'm going to say if it's not set I'm just going to redirect the user directly to the admin page to log in so um, if it is not set that's what the exclamation mark means not uh, and the thing we're checking is that admin session there okay. so if that's not set then we're going to do the following thing and I'm just going to use a, a redirect so I'm just going to go header and in brackets and speech marks it's just location and then the page we want to redirect to so you, know, you may want to redirect just straight back to the home page um, like I said probably a little bit more secure so we'll just do that um, so close the speech marks close the bracket semicolon so I'll save that now um, on my admin panel I'm just going to quickly um, put a link in here to that page um, and the text will just be add new category and the reason I'm doing that is just well obviously we'll need it on the next tutorial but also just to make it easier to navigate around um, right so when I'm here I'll just refresh my admin panel here we are so if I click on add new category it successfully works there it is it loads it up and you can see I'm on my add new category page and the reason that works is because the admin session is running however if I go back to my admin page and log out that session is no longer running if I try to be a bit sneaky and go directly to that page and watch what will happen it automatically redirects me back to the index page it does not allow me to get at that add category page so uh, instantly we have a password protected page okay so we will be re reusing uh, where are we this little bit of code here at the top of every secure page from this point on okay right so next time we will uh, actually do all the functionality of adding a new category I'll see you then bye